Dear everybody, Your Excellency, Mr. Ambassador, award recipients, and most importantly, dear audience. It is with great pleasure that I'm once again presenting one of this year's Hans Christian Andersen Award winners. It is always a great pleasure to be a part of celebrating one of Denmark's greatest culture bearers, Hans Christian Andersen, and not just, and not least to be a part of paying tribute to some of the people who have worked hard to make us all wiser about the writer and his enchanting fairy tales. Although it has been many years since the 2nd of April, 1805, when the world first met Hans Christian Andersen, his tales have become more important as time has passed. In many ways, he helped build the foundation for our shared cultural heritage, a heritage which were which we are constantly expanding upon and referring to. It constitutes the framework for an important cultural heritage. That is why the Hans Christian Andersen Award this year goes to Claudian Ritchie. His translations of 99 fairy tales by Hans Christian Andersen had made it possible for even more people to get an insight into the world of his fairy tales. With no less than 900 pages, Claudian Bitsche has conveyed one of the world's greatest authors to the Albanian audience. It has undoubtedly required hard work and late nights to process such a multifaceted contribution, a contribution that benefits both adults and children. It helps spread knowledge about Hans Christian Andersen's tales around the world, tales that we are gathered here to pay tribute to today. I'm therefore incredibly proud and happy that there are people like Claudian Petit who manage to expand knowledge. It gives new life to old tales. Tales about how dreams can come true if we just, if we just reach out for them. It is with strong translations like these that Hans Christian Andersen's fantastic tales can continue to inspire people around the world, young and old. That is why I'm also proud to be able to present the Hans Christian Andersen Award to Claudian Bucci, who is today represented by his publisher, not just Rita Petro, but also Sofiana Filippi. Uh, who are here with us today. Because contributions like this provide energy and inspiration to benefits our all. Thank you, and once again, congratulations.